what's the biggest surprise about the solar system itself? Is that, is that it's, it's typical or not typical? That it's unique or not unique? Uh, based on what you, you know, that and what we've seen now from exoplanets and things. Well, I would, I would give you two responses. One is that from the exploration of the solar system, this amazing enterprise you know, stretches back 50 years now, even 55, mm -hmm. going on 60 years since the earliest missions to the planets, just how rich nature is. Yeah. That every place we've gone, it just knocks, it blows our doors off. Whenever, every time I've, I've learned about the discovery of a new planetary system, Almost every time we have discovered, we thought our conventional wisdom told us what couldn't happen, happens. Yeah. Giant planets in, in the inner part of the solar system. Exactly. And all and these that's things the we other, didn't think could happen. The other thing I was going to say is then from what we've learned about exoplanet systems, we've learned that our solar system is very atypical. Yeah. It's, right? Everyone always, and that's, it, again, what, not what we thought. Yeah, we, we had a great little tidy logical story of why you should have rocky planets on the inside and gas yeah. giants on the yeah, outside. Yeah, it and sounded so good. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And nature, you know, is just so amazing. The imagination of nature is so much greater than the imagination of humans, which is why we have to keep exploring. Why we can't just have theoretical physicists like me in rooms, because we come up, if we figured out what's happening, the picture we have would not be the picture of the universe. We have to look outward because it keeps surprising us. We need the exploration. We need the explorers like you and the missions that you develop. We I need think. the data. Yeah, the data. And that's the basis of science, even, I know even for theoretical theorists, physics. It, it, data is a four-letter word. No, 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 no. For me, I mean, that's what guides theorists. In, I, at yeah. least I'm an old-fashioned kind of yeah. theoretical physicist that if, it, if it, the data... What, it doesn't matter whether it's elegant or beautiful or pretty. What matters is it correspond to reality. And the only way to know is to look out and find it.